Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. We've got a young man named Kyle that I met. Kyle was out doing some great things, helping people, helping people. Yes. Kyle is going to say my opening prayer. On you, Mr. Kyle. All right, Ms. Jazz, thank you. I appreciate it. Everybody bow your heads for me. Father God, I just want to say thank you for uh, blessing this uh, friendship with Miss Francis over here. And uh, thank you, Lord. We know that you don't make mistakes. Uh, you put people in your path for a reason. And Father God, I just want to say thank you for being so good and for blessing us and uh, always keeping us at the forefront. And um, I'm just grateful for friends like Miss Morgan here to my right. And I know that the Lord doesn't make mistakes. He puts people in our path for a reason. And um, I was just happy that I was able to be there for Miss Francis that day and um, help her out as best I could. And I just want to say thank you, Father God. God is good. Amen. All right, all right. All right, that's our, that's our friend there. That's one of my TV viewers you were helping now. Miss Francis, all right, all right. Yeah, we got to let him say, look at Colza walking up. This is uh, Colza Brown. He coming to meet him. See how we do it? We networking, networking, networking. Nice to meet you, Kyle. This is, uh, I'm Janice. Janice, please to meet you. See how we do it? David Brown. All right, all right. And, and what's your name, ma'am? Um, you you Kyle's mom, right? Yes. You raised him right, girl. Oh. You raised him <laughs> right. Okay, what's your name? Janice. Oh, Janice. Cece. My Cece. grandkids call me Cece. And, and what's your name? David. That's David. my dad, David. That's your dad. Boy, yes, both of y'all, look at that, both of them. They, ooh, they look like they're about seven feet. <laughs> yeah. You raised your son, right? Oh, thank uh, you. Coles had Sweet met Miss Francis, and Miss Francis had been in an accident, uh, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh... We just trying to help a little bit, you know. Right. She's doing good. She's doing great. But they brought her out to dinner, and this is how you do it. Look at Go Coast. We got all of them together there. You know something? God is good. This is what it's about. Get out and Amen. just be friendly. Sometimes That's people right. just need some company at times. They ain't asking for nothing. They just need a little company. That's right. All right, Jazz and Red. God is good. We love you. Yes, sir. We're going to pull time. back. That they all is, y'all. Wave and tell them. Tell them our God bless you. God bless you. All right. Peace out. Jazzy, Jazzy Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazzy Red. Uh, we up here with my buddy that makes me mad a lot, but today he from being a little okay because he didn't come in the sun. Uh, where you been today, Coz? Well, I've been down to the radio station, WGOK 900 AM, which uh, I'll be every Saturday at 1, well, 1255 to 155. Okay. Trent, hoping that I can say something to help somebody. All right. Uh, discourage somebody from doing something wrong. Yeah, trying to talk to them. Yeah, whichever way it go, you know. Because trying to lay something on their heart. Yeah, we need a lot of that because there's so many little simple things that we don't think about that really cause a big problem. Yeah, it is. And yes, I, it I, is. And I, I learn things like that, you know, every day when people, you know, have little arguments, you know, one say stuff about the other one, then the other ones, they get upset, and then you know anything, it, it, it goes into a big brawl. It you can know. escalate. Yes, if you have to, if yeah. somebody's not that immediate somebody, to try to keep that's it right. down, well, then it end up turning into a fight, that's a killing, right. and all that kind of stuff, you know? Oh, so, so we just got to learn to be careful with, with what we say and how we say it, because we never know what effect other people's mind and heart, so. You're right. You know, we, just, we don't know what a person have went through that's right. that day and what uh, they're going through. And what they going through, we don't know. So it's, it's just good to just be careful and not say yeah. anything to affect people or, or, or try to say something that's going to hurt them. You know, you never know. You never know. You can hurt somebody feelings of. Yeah. Some people be at the edge, man, and let's it just take kind. that one thing to push let's them off. Let's be kind. Let's be kind. Well, yeah, let's be nice, the man. The Lord wants us to have peace among ourselves, no matter what. And it should be nothing to separate us from the love of God. And if we separate ourselves from each other, well, that's what we're doing. Separate ourselves from the love of God. Now, you had said you were going to go back on that radio. Uh, COVID had stopped a lot of us. That's that, uh, right. That, and y'all was in a closed-in thing, so it was best that you did that, come yeah. out and just run your business. That's but right. But you said, you said, Red, I'm going back on the radio. Yeah, yeah, I have to go back because... <laughs> It's a lot of things. It's not so much of business-wise, but it's a lot of things that need to be said, you know, that uh, that could help people, you know. Yeah. And 
when you done went through a lot and experienced a lot, you know, but then you can you can tell people something. You know something, you can get on their level. Yeah. It's yeah, some yeah. people you can get on their level, and they like people that can get on their level. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to talk over a person like you're better than them, and yeah, you're, that's, that's not right. being able to yeah. talk to nobody. And the one thing about it, it's kind of hard to, to, to relate, to say something to people, if you haven't went through it yourself. You know something, that, and, and that, that'd be a real testimony. Yeah. When you, you know, go you in there. You got to be yeah. the went through it, you know. Yeah, you, you got to be, be the went through something. these type of things, you know. And yeah. I, I was talking to him today about, you know, things that are really going into our bodies that's really killing us. And yeah. We know we, we self murdering ourselves, you yes. know, with cigarettes and yes, we drugs. Are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. and all that different mm -hmm. stuff, you know. And... You know, it just don't make no sense. And I've been guilty of the same thing. But then I learned because my breath started getting a little shorter and I couldn't even have a conversation without catching my breath. Catching you know? your breath, wow. So I realized that this is the wrong thing to do. And so I stopped doing it. You and know what people are doing that are on the oxygen and smoking? Yeah. The doctor said, told him, told my sister and my mom, she is getting, you get air, you ain't got no air, mm -hmm. but you getting air from that machine to smoke. Yeah, that's ain't right. Ain't that something? And, and, and just suppose that, you know, they have an oxygen shortage, you know? Okay. I mean, what's going to happen then, you know? That's right, that's right. And so we do don't have, a, if you don't have a lot of money, you're going to be counted out. Yeah. So they going to let that option go to the people who got the money. Ain't that something? Because money is really the controller, you know? Yes, it is. And, and I was telling them on the radio today that, you know, money cannot buy two things that you really, really need. Okay. And that's salvation and, uh, and health. See, okay. money can't buy salvation and it can't buy health. Wow. And those are the two main things that you really need, you know, and money can't buy. So ain't no sense in holding on to that money and piling it up thinking that it's going to do you some good somewhere down the line, you know. And it's always good to save and try to have a little yeah, it is. something, it is. you know, to, 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 to live on in case something happened to you. But uh, just to just, you know, save it up like it's going to be uh, something that's going to get you salvation or something going to buy you help. Mm -hmm. that'll, be, that'll be a different story. Now, if it's going to buy my health, well, I couldn't help nobody, and it wouldn't help nobody. I got to, I got to worry about buying me some help, and I got to worry about buying some salvation. Yes, so when, I can't, when it can't do that for me, it's no sense of me being selfish, just holding on to everything I can. That's get. right. That's right. We, we also want to mention about uh, Open Hawaii. Uh, everything burned up over there. Uh, yeah, I don't know yeah. what the island that is. You know, but my oldest son lives in Hawaii. Oh, he, he do? He lives in that part. But, oh, wow. But he was across from there okay. you know, on the other side. Okay. And uh, as a matter of fact, I, the place that got burned out, the side that got burned out, well, I was there in, I don't know, but a few years ago, and, uh, and he was naming some of the places that we went to, and well, we went and got our nails done and all that yeah. stuff. Yeah, all that gone. All yeah. that is gone. Yeah, he's uh, he's on the other side. He said he never stopped selling food, you know. Oh, wow. Yeah, he have a food truck. Well, he'll be able to uh, help people because oh, folks yeah, don't, yeah, man, yeah, people. Well, and they ain't able to cook nothing, and everything burned down. Every a lot of those houses are burned down, cause. Yeah. Well, but he, you know what I seen though, cause I right. seen a picture. It was, all the houses were burnt around this church. This church didn't have no burns on it or nothing. Mm. The church was still standing. Now, isn't that something? That's good. It burned all around the church. I, 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 that was something miraculously I seen. Yeah, The that's church right. was still standing. That's right. With that white steeple, ain't mm. that something? So all they need to do is take heed to it now and yes, sir. make sure they go there. Yes, sir. I, I shared. I this said, look is, at the church. The church is there. Yeah, this is the safety zone. We, we got to do this. We're going to uh, help people. Tell them about your restaurant, Cozy. Yeah, well, we're located uh, at 4395 St. Stephen's Road, mm -hmm. where the old uh, the old uh, American Legion Hall was. We have that building, and, and we're, you know, doing whatever we can to help others. And when, you shop, when you're doing business with Cozy Brown's Kitchen, you're helping the community. Sure is. Because we really try to share and do whatever we can for our fellow man. And what you sell? We sell seafood, soul food, and barbecue. Oh, okay. This is the original soul food. 
Okay. It's not just soul food. Yeah, yeah. You know, we do things the right way and not saying other people don't, but we know what we do. Yeah. We don't know what Y'all got that do. flavor now. Macaroni yeah. and cheese, my, my yeah. work buddies were loving that. Yeah, well, we uh, just, you know, try to do it the way that we know to do it. Okay. And don't know what other people are doing. That's up to them. How about how about giving them that address and the phone yeah, number to the business? That address is 4395 St. Stephen's Road in mm -hmm. 8 Mile. Okay. That phone number is 251-456-4468. Okay, uh, what I'm going to do, all the information about his radio station. Yeah, some specials going. Oh, you got specials. Baked chicken dinner, mm -hmm. uh, seven fifty. dollars uh, bacon breakfast, uh, five fifty. Okay. We have shrimp pool boy, shrimp pool, I mean uh, popcorn shrimp, okay. and french fries for five ninety nine, mm -hmm. and we have that famous hamburger, that famous burger and fries for six ninety nine. dollars okay. $6 I think it is. Okay, all right. So, well, okay, yeah, all of that been going across the screen. I'm going to go around here and see if I can show them a plate. Let's see if we can show them a plate, one yeah, of your plates. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go around the front and see if we can show y'all a plate and show y'all what they're working with, okay? Yes, sir. All right, right. Jazz Red, we love you. Hey, hey, Coles, here you go. That's a prism for you. Yeah, he got a cat. Yeah, you know? he got a cat. I'm finna go. I don't want to hear about no picking no cat. Cause we don't pick no cat. I'm finna go. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear that. All right. You brought it to me. I just it because I didn't want. Get out my face. Get out my face. Bye. Jazz a red talk show. This young man was nice enough to let me show his plate. Look at this plate here. Look at he got two plates. What is that, young man? What is that? What that pork chop? Pork chop bigger than this. Macaroni, candy ant. Wow. Now we gotta let you show y'all this nice young man. Nice looking young man. Help me let me show his plate. There he is. Tell him hello. Say hello to Jazz up, Red Talk Show. What up, Jazz <laughs> Red Talk Show? Y'all need to come shop at Coles and Brown, man. Good food. You're gonna get full. Oh yes, you will. Alright, thank you, young man. Yeah, man. Wow. Jazz Red, we Jazz Red. <laughs> Jazz Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. Well, here we are. And we got some important dignitaries here. And Who's going to be the spokesperson? Mr. Care. What's your name? <laughs> My name is Antoine Connor. I'm the Vice President of Kingdom Covenant Connections. And uh -huh. it's time once again. Speak it's up. that time, y'all. Time for the annual Unity Walk event. Uh, an event geared on bringing unity and oneness to our communities, both local and abroad. Uh, just looking forward to inviting the community out and having a real good time and just, just embracing each other, networking. It's just a weekend of unity. Okay. When uh when is it? That will be September eighth through the tenth. Uh, uh -huh. We also have our ten days of uh ten days of prayer leading up to the event. Uh, what was that start August the thirtieth? The thirtieth through September the eighth. And again, that's just our ten days of prayer every afternoon right here in Lions Park. It's a way to set the atmosphere for the upcoming event. And then on September the eighth, we'll have our job fair right here in Lions Park from nine to three. We're going to invite a bunch of different staffing agencies, different companies that are going to be out to where you can come out and, and apply for jobs. It's just a way of bringing the, the, the job initiative to uh, to the event. Okay. Ms. Kara Coates, I'm going to want you to speak up because I know she's kind of, I'm finding her in there. Ms. Kara Coates. Yes, ma'am. All right. Come on to the front. Come on. Come on. Right. How long you been doing this? How long you been doing this? This is 18 years. Come on to the front. <laughs> y'all see how I gotta do her? Yeah, see how gotta stand on up, stand on up, girl. Okay. Y'all know something. Let him. Let me come over here. Y'all see what I? Y'all see? Y'all see what I have to go through? Y'all see what I gotta go through? Huh? I love her, but y'all see what I go through? All right. Now you gonna speak up because you got a soft boy. Thank you. All right. All right. Come on with that information. Come on with that information. We've been, uh, this is our 18th year celebration, and we have a lot of our partners here with us um, joining us. We have uh, the Roll Offs coming, uh, rock, rock and Roll Roll Off. Okay. They're going to help us. We have uh, Pastor Mass here with um, Community Matters. Okay, Joseph Mash. Our, uh, we have some of our exhibitors here. We have our sound team here. Thank okay, Bright. sound Steve team. Right. Y'all know her? Yeah, Ministries. We have Waymaker here. Waymaker, oh. raise your hand. Raise your hand. Here, huh? Waymaker okay. in the back there. there Waymaker, go. I can't see you. You hiding. Ah, uh -uh, you ain't got to stoop down. He know what I'm talking about. He ain't, all right, all right. That way, maker. And guess what? We have uh, Pastor Victor here. Hey. All right. Baptist 
All right. Raise your hand up. Raise your hand. All right. All right. And our chaplain and his wife here. All right. Chaplain and wife. All right. Prayer line. Amen. All right. For the prayer line. group here. All right. And we have our National Day of Prayer Task Force team here. Okay. National Day of Prayer. 10 days of prayer. All right. All right. We have Miss Bowie. She's one of our uh, exhibitors that'll be here, too. Okay. All right. We're going. All right. We got some hey. in here. Okay. <laughs> Who is the young man in the back? Who is that young man? That's God's son back there. Yeah. That's Trey. <laughs> okay. That's yeah. God's son. All, type of volunteers all right. Here. Yes. So we have volunteers of all ages that will be here. Mm -hmm. All right. So we just we, we need your help. How long you been doing this? 18 years. 18 years. <laughs> 18 years. Started out as a one-day event, and we are 12 days now. 12 days. Man. Yes, 12 days. <laughs> okay. So um, God be the glory. Yes. Give them the location again. All right. This is Lions Park. You can see Spring Hill Avenue right out here. Okay. Now, 12 days consists of what? Come on. What we doing? All right. So, what we doing? All right. Come on. Talk about the first 10 days. Come on. Come on, on y'all. Bring it on. My name is Felicia French, and I'm with the National Day of Press City of Mobile. Okay. And we're going to come out on the 30th of August. We're going to be here walking around the park as the Lord leads, and we're praying for our city oh. leading up to the event. So we will pray each night at 5 p.m. We invite everyone to come out, regardless of your denomination. Please come out and join in with us as we lift our city up in prayer. So that's 10 consecutive days. Someone will be here. If you're not able to be here, we're circulating flyers that have a call-in number. We ask that you would simply call in, and you can pray during that time as well over the phone. So oh. thank you so much. Oh, they can pray over the phone. Amen. All right. And, uh, we, we, uh, we want to introduce our sound team. Come on. Okay, come on, sound team. Come on up, come on up. We're burning up daylight. Look, and it's hot out here. And it's hot out here. Oh, y'all know that man. I know him. We was acting in the movie. I know him. We can't, we can't say what we act. We can't say what we did. But uh, he was in the we movie. Had a good time. Okay, we had a good time. Theo Bright was there. And this young man, what's your name? Michael Glenn. Yeah, all right. Y'all going to see him. All right. I can't say nothing. I can't say nothing. It's a secret. But uh, what are y'all going to do for that Sunday? Is it Sunday? Uh, yes, it's Sunday, Saturday, mm -hmm. and Sunday. We're okay. in charge of recruiting inspirational entertainment uh -huh. for Saturday community concert and Sunday King of Kings concert. And we make a music, not only is he a performer, but a recruiter and a minister. And come on, tell us about Waymaker Music. Waymaker Music, uh, we are. Speak up. Okay. Speak up, baby. Speak up. Okay. Waymaker Music, mm -hmm. um, we are a God fearing uh, uh, entity in the community that we go out and uh, minister to and outreach in the drug stricken areas and communities. And we're just coming together collectively with the Old Bright Ministry to uh, assist in sound, uh, whatever uh, that's uh, concerning the sound. Okay. We're going to be uh, facilitating it from the stage to the mics uh, to. Uh, uh, getting other people's music lined up. We're gonna okay. We're going to make sure everything flows real smoothly. Okay. okay. And I just wanted to add one thing that Professor Robert Mack is going to be headlining the King of Kings concert this year. Okay. Right here at Lions Park, Spring Hill Avenue, and Catherine Street from 2 to 6 on Sunday. And we're going to start early in the morning on Saturday with the walk, come back here for the concert, and feed you people. All the homeless people. Okay. Come on out, get some clothes, get some shoes, get your hair cut. I mean, you just join the family. We oh. are about unity. Okay. So we want you to come on out and unite. Okay, come here, Caracoats. Right. Caracoats are always hiding. This lady here started this thing. Come on, come on, come on, come on, baby. If y'all don't want to talk, I'll... let me cut this off. All right, Jazz Red, we back. What's your name, young man? Minister Andre Robinson. Okay. Tell us, uh, what you gonna tell us? Well, what I'm gonna tell you is uh, this, this is all a ministry to reach out to people and try to win souls for Christ and also help people who are having problems, uh, it might be mental health, maybe homelessness. And we just want them to know that they're still children of God. And that situation they're in is not permanent, it's not lasting, mm -hmm. it's only temporary. And as long as they don't lose hope, you know, and that's part of what we're here for. Okay. Is to help give someone else hope 
because God blessed us and somebody prayed okay. for us. Somebody talked with us and at some point somebody gave us a hand. Okay, Joseph Mash, come here, Joseph. Okay. Tell them something. Uh, my part here with uh, this ministry and this outreach is basically to help get the message out. And so I do some video work, some shots and some things and similar to what you're doing and just helping to get the message out that uh, come and be a part of what's going on. I think it's a powerful movement and uh, that we just want everybody to be involved. Okay, young yeah. man in that gray shirt, come on with it. Pastor Victor Herman with First Baptist Chickasaw. I'm just a messenger. Uh, just to let you know that there is power in unity. We're calling all Christians to come out. Like my brother said, there's going to be opportunities to witness, to share the gospel. There's going to be a lot of lost souls down here. And there is power in unity. God okay. commands a blessing where he sees unity. Okay. All right. Come in, Miss Care Coach. Come in, Miss Care Coach. Now. Nah. All right. We got a picture of everybody. I'm scanning their face. Care, what inspired you to do this? Get it while I'm scanning. All right. Speak up. Well, to bring uh, everyone together, to pull down the walls that separate us all. And we just want to know, we just want you to know we're stronger and better together. And we could just help each other. We want to bring the unity back in community. Okay? So okay. this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Everybody together. Yes. Everybody together. How many, how long, how, again, how many years you been doing this, Karen? This is 18 years. <laughs> wow. Everybody, 18 years. 18 years. And this Amen. is our chaplain and his wife. They're over at our prayer line that uh, goes on every Tuesday and Friday night. Chaplain, say hello. Say hello. hello there. What's your name, <laughs> Chaplain? Apostle Paul Mayer. All right, all right. All right. Now, uh, on our ending, Carrie, you're going to tell them again. I'm getting everybody. Tell them when this is. Give us ad, give us uh, well, dates. Come on, come on, okay. dates. We are we are going to actually, the prayer will start uh, August the 30th, and we'll end September the 8th. That's 10 days of prayer with our National Day of Prayer team. Mm -hmm. That's heading, helping us to head this up. And then we have... Uh, coming up that Saturday, mm -hmm. the un an annual unity walk. We are going to walk together down these streets, just showing what unity looks like. And we're going down to Unity Point Park, and we have the LaFleur family and the Langan family that will be out here walking with us. We'll be recognized, recognizing them as well. And uh, we also have the concert that will be going on Saturday okay. and Sunday. All right. So we have praise and worship, and we have the clothes out here. We have shoes. Uh, we are ready for everyone, and we have another partner back here. One more time, Roloff, where are you? Come on over here. Come on up. Come on up. Come on up. We, Miss Roloff, what is Roloff? What is it? What is Roloff? What is Roloff? Well, Rock and Roloffs is a portable toilet rental company as well as a dumpster rental company, and what we're doing for Miss Carey is we're bringing out all the garbage cans and the portable toilets that are going to be needed as well as the animal Okay. Wow. Y'all remember right. roll off then. All right. All right. All right. Have we got all our information out? We got all of our information. All right, ladies and gentlemen, everything for uh, Kingdom Covenant Connection, everything have been rolling across that screen. Please make sure you know to have a pencil and a paper when Jazz Red come on because we're going to tell you some good things. All right. right. One other thing. Come on with it. If you got something we ending, come on. We just want to say, if you want to learn more about these, these events that's upcoming, you can go to our website, KingdomCovenantConnections.com. You can go to our Facebook page, Facebook.com slash Kingdom Covenant Connections, our Instagram page, uh, username Kingdom Covenant Connections. It's all about unity. It's all about oneness. It's all about networking, and that's what we're providing for these days. Come okay. On. Okay, Ms. Kerr. Yes. What's your name? What's your name? Um, Minister Pastor D.C. Ferguson. Okay. All right. And you're going to be here? You can you speak up? Yes, I can speak up. But I'm not used to this. So I know. Okay. But anyway, it's a blessing to be part uh -huh. of this Kingdom Covenant Connection and Unity Walk. I was part of it years ago. Okay. You know, and it's interesting. And I'm just glad to see it mature and it'll be about the okay. price coming up. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. Not All right. Young volunteers, get out here and help us. Okay, okay. yeah. The young yeah. The, he yeah. that's a young volunteer there, y'all. Y'all I'm gonna show y'all I'm doing a scan. I'm scanning the scan of everybody. All right, y'all gonna say, God bless. One, two, three. God bless. All right, Jazz Red, we love you.
Jazz Hurry Talk Show. Look, I brought my cousin down here to help me. And uh, he helping them. He getting the boxes and stuff. He loading up. Look at that. Uh-oh, look at that. Technicality on Jazz Hurry Talk Show. That's my cousin, Derek. Hey, yeah, uh, Derek helping them load up some stuff. He said, I'm coming to help Red. I help you, Jazz, and he helping. Peace out. <laughs> Jazz Red talk show. That she getting him lined up. That Frankie Sodomo, she getting him lined up. She getting him lined up. <laughs> he going into the sunset. Peace out. <laughs> Jazz Red talk show. We've got Miss Fanny Finkley here. How you doing today, Miss Fanny? I am blessed today. Oh, okay. We're down here in Florida again. What are you? What are you all doing? Yeah, here in Pensacola, Florida, we had the Great True Vine Baptist Church and Pensacola Carry Hearts. What we're doing here today, we're giving out over 40,000 pounds of food to the families that are in need. Families that are in need. Oh, yeah, and anybody needs food. Anybody? Yeah. Now, now, how long you been doing this, though? Oh, about... About 20 years. 20 years? Long time. How many pantries you got? I have three pantries. Three pantries? Yes. One what? in Evergreen, Alabama. Uh-huh. And here in Pensacola, Florida. Wow. We just make sure nobody has to go home. What, what inspired you to want to feed people? Well, I, it's just my calling. Wow. Yeah. And, uh, I just want to be a blessing to others. I want to make sure that people just don't have to go hungry. I want to be one of those ones that will be able to feed them. Wow. I know it's in your heart, Miss Fanny. Oh, We've been following you a little bit, chasing you. Uh, when you opened uh, the pantry, the last one you opened was where? Uh, in Evergreen. Evergreen, Alabama. Yeah, we went up there, me and Pastor Haywood, we rolled up there. You got a lot of diligent people that work with you, and we hope that uh, we, what we're going to do, we're going to show what y'all, what they working with. We're going to show what y'all oh, yeah. doing. Let me give our, our location. Is okay. 2105 West Gregory Street. They're right on the corner of Gregory and Pace in Pensacola, Florida. Our number is 850-375-1838. All right. Y'all got all that in a nutshell. Jazz Red, it's going across the screen. Jazz Red, we love you. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show, we got an important dignitary. Come over here in this sun, man. All right, there you go. Tell, tell my TV viewers what you do. Because you do a little bit of everything here, man. Tell I just I just try to help organizations be able to take, and we feed the people, we give clothes to the people, we give furniture to the people. It's about the people. Wow. Just if one person can take and give back, and we can take and we can multiply that, that will take and enhance a lot of things in people's lives. That's Some right. people, all they need is just to know that somebody cares. Somebody cares. A smile, a thank you. Wow. Uh, if you see a man, woman, or child on the side of the road, you give them a few dollars. It's not what they do with it. It's the thought that you gave to them. That's you know, right. That's, that's right. It. You know, I That's just right. love doing this video. Now, now, what's your name? Tony Carter. Man. And what you do other than this? Come on with it. I know, but you do a lot of other stuff. That man helped veterans and everybody. He don't want to talk, but he kind of acting shy today. Uh, he do a lot. So, yeah, name again? Tony Carter, man. Basically. Appreciate you, Tony. You had every, you, you had every food, food. You live in Florida? Yes, ma'am, I do. I okay. Okay, right in Pensacola. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for coming out and helping Miss Fanny and caring for hearts and the church and everything. Thank you, ma'am. All right. Jazz Red, peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. They're getting ready, and they are rolling. This is the, like a like a conveyor belt. They putting it all up. I'm here early. I'm here early. Jazz Red Talk Show. Got a young man, that lady there, she always here helping. They are helping. Wow. Look at him, ladies and gentlemen. Look at him. Jazz wants y'all to know they care about people, man. This is what they do. This is what they do. <laughs> What'd you say, sister? She care about the ones that need something to eat. She care about the hungry and the ones that need something to eat. That's what she said. Jazz Red, we love you. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show, we here with some sisters, and they were here the last time. I know them faces yeah. look familiar, yeah. and they are working, working. Yeah. working. Straight out of Shantytown, but I don't have my shirt on. Yeah, but yeah. still got my red hair. Y'all still got, got that red hair. <laughs> uh, they're loading up. What is that? Is that hot sauce? Or? 
Swing sauce or? Sweet chili sauce. That's sweet chili, chili sauce. sauce. That you can put on your wings. You can put a, uh, put them the egg rolls. Oh, egg rolls and stuff. Yes, yeah. yeah. All yes. right. So you know the Chinese gonna be out getting this here. Girl, if they knew y'all, they'd be out here. <laughs> yes, they give, they Especially giving out. Oh, look, stuff. they got vegetables too. They got corn. How you doing, sis? Yeah. All right. She's bagging up the corn. They got fresh corn. Look at that. How y'all like that? Look like it's gonna be different things every time I come out. Ain't that something? They getting the corn together. Amen. All right, they got eggplants too. Jazz had uncovered them. Let you see them. Got eggplants. Jazz are red. We love you. Eggplants. That it's so bright up here. I can't see. Can y'all see them, ladies and gentlemen? Peace out. They got boxes of corn. Boxes of corn. They working. These sisters serious down here. They serious down here. And now when I tell you, they loading up the truck to head to Beverly. They are. Look at that. Look at that lady picking up that box. Yeah, look at that. God bless her. Lord have mercy. They work. <laughs> All right, they got juice. They're giving out. Go, wait a minute, wait a minute. What is that good? What is that good? Good, what you got there? We got milk. Y'all got milk. Y'all got milk and you. Minute made. Minute made. Minute made juice. They handing it out. They got the works. They got the works. They handing it out, ladies and gentlemen. They're packing it up. We got They're getting. Cold. Oh yeah, I, girl, I like the corn. You know you can put that corn in the microwave, take the shuck off it, keep the cover on it. Girl, y'all got it, girl. Y'all got it. You can put it in the microwave and cook it that way. That's what I'm talking about. Put it put, put, put on that grill. Oh, oh. That girl gonna fire the grill. I worked that shipyard. I ain't going outside. Jazz Red, we love you. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show. I'm holding them up. They working. They working. Days working. Look at him. Look at the bags. Look at him. Look at him. They get them, they get the boxes, they put it on the table, they bag it up, they're getting ready. They're getting ready to give out. They lining up. They lining up, y'all. They lining up. They're lining up. They're getting it organized now. In a minute you're gonna see them getting ready to give it out. Jazzered, we love it. When I tell you, it's some food down here in Florida. It's Fanny Finkley. Lord, this lady have blessed so many people. Look at that. She has blessed so many people. And she got some sandals helping. What, what, what inspired y'all to come out here and help today? Hmm? The Lord. The Lord? Nothing but the Lord. Nothing but the Lord. When the people help you, wow. you help them. That's right. That's right. And Nothing but the Lord. The Lord and brought you out here. What brought you out here, young man? What brought you out here? The community. The community brought you yes, out here. Efforts. To help others. To help others. Oh, yes. Y'all receive it. Peace oh, yeah. out. <laughs> right. Eggplants. There'll be different things that they give out on different things. And I mean, they got it ready. They're going to get in there and they're going to fill them trucks up in the back. Look at that mini made and that milk. They finna hand it out, baby. Jazz Red, we love you. Peace out. Okay. There go my cuz. He's, he's getting... finna, yeah, he's finna pray. He's finna bless the food he's getting. Oh, okay. My cuz gonna bless the food. We gonna let him bless the food here. Okay. Hold up, y'all. Hold up. This my cuz. He gonna bless the food down here in Pimp's Cave. Most righteous and holy Father, we thank you, Lord, for blessing us to come together, Lord, in the name of Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for blessing us to be obedient to your word and give back to your people. Father, we thank you, Lord, for putting it on the hearts of the people, Lord, who have put this together. Continue to bless them, Lord. Strengthen them, encourage them, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Bless those that's coming out, Lord. Bless them, Lord, to have no accidents, no danger coming to them, Lord. Bless them, Lord, to go back to their, their home, their destination, with no harm, no danger. In the name of Jesus, we pray and thank you. Amen. Amen. That's my cuz there. Peace out. <laughs> Jazz Red Talk Show, this man here, look at that. Look at that, he getting these watermelons. He putting these watermelons in the car. Get in there and put it in that car, young man, Lord, look at that. Big strong men down here. That's what I'm talking about. And don't be calling me for no phone number, ladies. Jazz Red, we love you, peace out. Jazz Red versus Bob uh, Talk Show, it's so tight. Look good, what you got here? You got your motor scooter, your bicycle, and it's pink. It's pink, brother. You know I don't like pink, but she got a pink motor, a, a, mo, a bike. I call them motor scooters because I got a bike too. Thank you, brother, for buying my bike for me two couple of years ago. Lord, and what's your name, ma'am? Francis. Francis. Thank you for letting me interview you there. We gonna get you. She got a flat. We gonna get her. We gonna get her some. We gonna get her some patches from the Dollar Tree. I'm send my cousin up there. Somebody. Peace out. 
Jazz Red Talk Show, they rolling. They rolling. When I tell you they rolling, they walking. They walking to the car. We walking. Yes, indeed, they talking for yes, you and me. <laughs> Go on like a cheerful girl. Cud done broke a sweat. He got him a rag. When you had your rag, Cud, where you pick your rag up at? It was in the car. Okay. He got him a, got him a towel there. He helping. Wow. Wow. Look at him, y'all. Look at him. Look at him. We don't care if the wind and the lean thing. Lean back. We'll tell them, go on lean back. We still going to get it out because the wind blowing down here. We don't care. Uh, if somebody want to donate some big tents, holler at them because uh, they, they trying, y'all. They are doing it. They're not trying. They're doing it. But if you want to give a donation, the phone number is going across the screen to help feed people. I mean, I tell you, this lady will feed anybody. She really will. It don't matter. It don't matter because some folks work and bought stuff like I did. When I was working, I bought stuff. When you're laid off or you retire, it ain't all there like you used to get. But with the help of the Lord and these folk down here, baby. And we got some people in giveaway, but today is all about Pensacola again. Peace out. This here is all corn and egg plants. This is all corn and egg plants. They got it just stacked up. How y'all like that? Hmm. I mean, and they giving it out. These people were lined up this morning to get it. They got two. Y'all got two lines up in here. Wow. Peace out. Wow. Right. That, that, that sister there, look at, look at that sister. Look at that sister putting it in that car. Tony good. Tony. These sisters get down down here. Hey, Amen. Jazz Red Talk Show. What's your name? What's your name, sister? Shelly Kostoffin. Hey, how you doing? All right. What, you, what made you come up here today? Just volunteer to help the people that need. Oh, God bless you, sister. That's what I'm talking about. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show. We zooming in to him. He back there hiding, tearing up boxes. I'm doing a little work. You're doing a little work then. All right, then. He getting it in. What's your name? My name is Darrell Thompson. All right. Thank you, Mr. Dream. Thank you for coming out to help. Peace out. Hey, you loading up creamer? Are yes, you, huh? Yes, ma'am. Oh, you loading up creamer. Wow, what's your name? Kenya. Kenya, you, you loading up creamer. They putting the creamer in the bag. He, he tying up bag. I don't know what they ain't doing. Look like they just multiple tassels here. Multiple tassels. I don't want y'all to see them in action now. I don't want y'all to think that they down here sitting in chairs or they don't smoke because they say, but they ain't down here sitting in chairs. They drink their water when they need it, but they go back to work. They have not left here. They have not left here. They don't even know I'm filming. They don't know I'm filming. That's good. They just working. And that's what it's about. We don't care that the wind and blow them. Donate us some tents down here. <laughs> we can use some big white tents, some more expensive ones. Jazz Red, we love you. They're trying to help. Y'all, you know something? This stuff is good on them. Yes, this stuff yes, is. Tell them, come it on is. Down. Yeah. Well, I, yeah, down. they got to come from Mobile and come on. They say, come on from Mobile and get you yeah, some yeah, food. Yeah, We're going to try to see if we can let them see when they have it the next time. And we'll let them know. We'll let them know in case they want to ride down here to Florida. They say, they don't mind you coming on down. Peace come out. On by, come on by. <laughs> Hold up, Win. Yeah, yeah. Win, win, win. Hold up, win. Good, you, girl, that's some good salt. That is some good sauce, though. You can put it on right. Miss Fanny walking. She be walking and handling business. I just have to catch her whenever. She rolling. Look at her roll. She gone. She gone. I ain't gonna catch her. I ain't gonna catch her. Sister, packing. They packing, y'all. They packing. That thing is full there. I came a little early, so they packing. They got it going on. Wow. That's red. We love you. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show. Sister, you've been out here. You out here again. What is you doing in the sun? I'm trying to provide assistance to Karen Hall and Greater Two Vine Baptist Church. Wow. I'm a volunteer from Greater Two Vine Baptist Church. Wow, you're a volunteer from the church. Yes. I hope your pastor coming today is going to come by. Well, he should. Well, he, made, he came the last time because I wanted to let him know. He told me about my keys. Uh -huh. I had lost my son new keys to his Audi. Uh -huh. He said, you're going to go and find him. We finna pray. He prayed on me, and I found him in the bottom of the pocketbook in Atlanta. Amen. I got to tell him, girl. I got to tell him. Jazz are red. We love you. Okay. Peace out. <laughs> watermelon, man. That watermelon, man. <laughs> I like this. We got we got the, the traffic director here. This is the traffic director out there in that orange shirt. There. Hey y'all, uh, traffic director. He directing traffic. I don't remember that. No, no, we got another traffic traffic director. Traffic director. Frank and Sodom all there. Traffic director. 
Oh! <laughs> Peace out. Oh, uh, this your vice president? What's your vice? What's your name, sis? Hi, my name is Zio Segway, and I'm with Pensacola Karen Hart. Also with the Scammy Santa Rosa Safety Coalition. So we collaborate, come together, and uh, feed the hungry. Wow. Yeah, it's very rewarding. It's you know, hot out here? Yes. And y'all are getting it in. Y'all yes. helping people. That's what we love to do. That's an inspiration. You know, that's the Karen Hart. Dog. Right? <laughs> nice yeah. meeting you. My Your name again? Z or C Gwen. All right, Jazz Red, right. we love you. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. We got a sister, so she be watching my show here. Wow, y'all wave on my toy baby. Hi. What's your name? My name is Charmaine. And yours? I'm just so excited to be so happy to be here to be part of the community. Oh, that is nice. They say they watch my show. Yes, nice meeting you all. Thank you so much. Y'all know I interviewed Peggy Scott Adam. Oh, yeah. oh my That's God. our girl, and Yeah. Jazzeray, we I'm love you. Say Peace hello out. To my children, okay. My yeah. And our entire family. Entire family. Bless you with your event. It's going to be very for Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Peace out. Love you. All right. <laughs> They're going to be working out here in the rain, y'all, because it's trying to drizzle. We're going to hope that God hold it up. Hold up the rain till they get everything in and everybody calls. Hold up, rain. Hold up now. Peace out. They rolling though. Now that's an inspiration when they tell me, I love you, I love your show. Nah, I don't be knowing who's looking at it, but thank you very much. Wow, I met some new fans. Yeah, all right, Jazz Red gonna do the thing when she go to Atlanta. I'm gonna do the thing. Peace out. Jazz Red talk show. We got this man moving. He was rolling. I was looking for, I said, I know he out here somewhere. He getting it in, getting it in. All right, peace out. <laughs> There's a red talk show. I got the rev here. What's your name, rev? rev I'm Reverend Isaac L. Williams. All right, let's get in the sun here. We're going to try to get you out of sin. There he is. Now, 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 uh, Reverend William, what church? What's the name of your church? The name of our church is Greater True Vine Baptist Church of Pensacola. Now, I'm going to tell you, I was asking, was you coming? I'm going to tell you why I asked, was you coming? <laughs> All right, when I was here last time, y'all. A couple weeks my, ago. A couple of weeks ago. My son, I had lost my son, brand new Audi key. He had given me a key to the car and I had lost it. I said, Rev, I got to tell that boy I ain't got that key. I said, Rev, I can't tell him, Rev. Rev, I lost that key. What you told me, Rev? I said, just pray about it. God will reveal to you where that key is. I said, I said, I I said Rev. where it is, but you pray and ask God. I said, in fact, I'm going to pray with you. Let's just pray in the name he of the Lord Jesus Christ. He God prayed God revealed to her where that key is. He should, and we left it like that. Left it like that. I got home. I said, Rev, pray for him, but I, I ain't got that key, Lord. I ain't mad, but I told my daughter, don't tell my son I lost the key. He knocked that door. My mom need you to crank the car up and leave once we up. Son, I got to go and tell you that. I ain't, I ain't lost that key. I, I, I got it somewhere. That's what I said. I ain't know where that key was. But I went back in that house and I said, now, real pray for me. And I'm going to find that key, I believe. I said, I'm going to just, I said, I'm going to look in that pocketbook one more time. Real, it was in the liner, in the bottom. I felt in the bottom of the pocketbook. I said, there that key is. Glory. <laughs> Thank you, God. There that key Yeah, is. you Rev, see what come. faith will do. She Love. said she believes she's going to do it. <laughs> and if you can only have faith, I heard Jesus say, if you had the faith the size right. of a mustard seed, yes, sir. you can speak to your mountain. You may have some mountains going on today, but just have faith and see what will happen to them. Wow, if y'all want this room to pray for y'all. In fact, I'll pray right now. Come on, pray All for those me. out there in the listening and viewing audience, okay. let, let us go before Wait a minute, God give, me, give, me, give me your hat. Phil. You, you me love me? Hat. See, I love yeah. to pray with my hat on. Oh, you, you all like me take my hat I off. I want you to take that yeah, hat off. Yeah, each time I did it when I was did. at a dedication. That's all right. Give me that I hat. had to do the whole thing oh, over. We had to do listen, it over. Listen, uh. my, your prayer can go through the hat, <laughs> through the roof. My prayer can get there. Come on with it. Let us go before God. God, we thank you now for privilege of prayer. And God, I just come humbly as I know. And I lift up all those who are under the sound of my voice in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. God, I lift them up and as I lift them up, oh God, I pray you will hold them up. You will grant them now everything they need for this day, for their journey. God, you know what they need now. And I pray in the name of Jesus, you will grant it. Have your way now, God. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Stand right there, Rev. Let me crown you. Now, now, no, hey, Rev like it. Rev like it, cut. Rev like it, cut. He yeah, like it. Uh, let me come over there by you, Rev. I, I, I love my hat. Give him, 
I got to give him a real yeah, hug. Yeah, oh, hey, God bless you. you. God bless you. He All right. told me he was praying for Amen. that Amen. We praying in the name of Jesus. Amen. Key, God y'all. bless you. I found that key. <laughs> Jesus, name. Amen. 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 Now, don't take my, my head gonna start burning now. Oh, you'll be all right. <laughs> Peace out. Let him know. Y'all, yeah, they over there getting it together. They all getting the land. <laughs> Look, they making sure that they get it together. They getting the land together. They gotta make sure they got everything together. They they directing here. They directing. They all directing now. They making sure they get the get the stuff to the people. They directing. Peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. What's your name, young man? My name is Larry Williams. Okay, what you do? I, uh, I volunteer whenever I get an opportunity. I participate in the community affairs, and I represent the good people of District 3 on the East Wow. Yes, 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 yes. Well, you're a very important dignitary, then. You're out here working in the sun. What make you come out here? Oh, because Miss, Miss Fanny does as much as anybody I know to help the community. So whenever somebody's doing anything, to help communities, and I try to be a part of that good work that they're doing. So that's why I'm out here. Amen. That's why I'm out here. Amen. It Thank you. You get to see people do. It is. Oh, yeah. It yeah. is. Thank you. Jazz Red, peace out. Jazz Red Talk Show. Uh, let me know. Uh, Frankie Sadamo. Yes. Peggy Scott Adam, brother. Yes, ma'am. What, uh, how, when did y'all start? Uh, I got 10? started at 6 a.m. Truck. But I'm talking about. At 6 a.m. you got started, but what time did the car start? The car started at 10. What time is it now, sir? 11.25. 11.25. Y'all been out here an hour, well, y'all been out here longer than that. But y'all been out here an hour and a half. We've had over 200 cars. Y'all, y'all got, y'all still got land, though. And still coming. And it's wrapped around that corner. And we still got plenty of food for them. And you still got stuff for them. That's why God does it. Y'all ain't, y'all have not ran out, man. We don't play that. Y'all don't play running out. No, we don't run out. So oh wow! We never run out. Never, never run out. We I have see yet that. To run out. I seen. I seen. It just be people that just yeah. ain't no more coming, and then it's over with. That's the difference between running out and giving out. We that give is. It all out. I give it all yeah. out. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes yeah. we gotta go in the stash. We go get something. Y'all yeah, do. Y'all yeah, do. I Some see her going. Come in late, and they got the need. We the one to feed. God, dog. Yeah. I seen her, Miss Fanny fed some people the other week, and they had came when y'all closed. She still got a yeah. box together for that lady. Yeah, the girl was pregnant. Man, I'll never forget that. Yeah. Young man helped her unload the other day. She took care of him and his family. Make sure. Here, volunteering the day. Make sure. Make sure he got something for yeah. his family. She always doing that. Yeah. All right. Jazz Tell Red. Tell get on the phone and call the people that come to come yeah. get something. Yeah, they got to come get something to eat. Jazz Red. Don't nothing but some time. Jazz Red. You a veteran? Yes. Thank you for fighting for our country. Still Thank sir. you for fighting. What you was in? Army. All right. Left flank. Mark. <laughs> Jazz Red. Peace out. <laughs> Yeah, the Red Sox talk show. I didn't get this, sister. Him. What's your name, sister? What's your name? Bertha. What is it? Bertha Lambert. Bertha Lambert. What made you come up here? What made me come up here? Yeah, what I'm made you come here? Hard. You remember then? Oh, yeah, I'm a member. Okay, then you were going to come anyway. Oh, I'm going to come in. Anyway. Oh, wow. Oh, y'all, are, y'all are doing a great job. Thank You're you doing so much. a great job. And still oh, got... I get names and uh, direct traffic, so... Oh. I am. Uh, thank God for my what I'm doing. All right. Jazz Red, we love it. Peace oh, out. Yeah. Look at it real. He done work. Now he going to go in there. He digging in and getting watermelon. Ain't this something? Look at him. He don't see me from him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him eating watermelon <laughs> under a cool tree. Amen. Cuz still hanging with me, y'all. I'm letting you know Cuz still. <laughs> My cousin's still here. Yeah, that's my first cousin there. My hey, mama's hey, sister hey. child. Peace out. That lady there running the rib off. Say, Rib, you out here talking to everybody. Get on, Rib. Rib out here talking to everybody. They told him, get gone. They told him, get gone. They done ran him out. Get on out of there, Rib. Peace out. <laughs> Jazz Red Talk Show. Look who in the car. He said he wants to share watermelon too. Jazz Red, we love you. Peace out. Ain't he cute? Peace out. <laughs> all right, this sister here, she doing the paperwork. She get all the ID, and some, uh... You're not on TV. Okay. No, uh-uh, I ain't on, baby. I know what I'm doing. I'm we got them. We ain't getting nobody. We ain't getting nobody. She got a mask on where I can't see her, no way. Jazz Red, we love you. This lady here is out here getting them sign things and tell the information, whatever they doing. Jazz Red. We love you. Peace out. 
Jazz Red Talk Show, and I'm your host, Jazz Red. We got some important dignitary. We finna pull out of Pensacola, Florida, but I just gotta let them say something, cause they don't work so hard today. I'm sitting down looking at them. Who wanna go first? I'll go first. Okay. Pensacola Caring Hearts and Grady Truvine. Speak up a little bit. Pensacola Caring Hearts and Grady Truvine Baptist Church. Uh huh. Pastor Isaac William is our pastor. Today we gave out over 40,000 pounds of food. Wow. Ms. Jezreel, I want to thank you for taking time to come down and be with us to spread the good news. But I want to especially thank Ms. Fanny Fink, a heart that's bigger than the whole city. It sure just is. just love blessing folks day in and day out. And so we want you all to keep her prayed up as she continue to do the Lord's work. You are right. Yeah, man. Yes, we thank end. Y'all. Thank y'all for being here. We thank just being able to give Carter. this to the people. I'm Tony Carter. Whatever I can help, whatever I can do for my mom, I'm gonna do that. I'm here for my mom, I'm here for the past, I'm here for the community. This is what we do. Wow. Now I'm gonna bag up, hold up right there. I want y'all to see them, all three of them. When you get three peanuts in a nutshell, you got good luck. Cause you know it don't usually be but two in there. Don't normally be but two. Jazz have read the phone number to the organization. What is the organization? Yes, the code of Karen Hearts, 850-375-1838. And the church? The True Vine, 850-438-6009. All right, Jazz of Red, we love you. We finna get out this sun. We finna get out this sun. Peace out. Damn.